April 13th, a small gift. That was great. Jesus was standing near the church door one day. Not very far away from the door stood some big boxes. On the top of these were small holes. Can you guess what they were for? As the people walked into the church, they dropped pieces of money through the holes into the boxes. They were giving love gifts to God. Jesus watched the people as they put their coins freely in the gift boxes. Here came a man dressed in beautiful robes of bright colors. He had a money bag with him. It had so much money in it that the pieces were jingling together and made a great noise. The man put his hand down into the bag and brought out some pieces. Very proudly, he dropped them into the box. But first, he looked around to see if everyone was watching him. He wanted the people to know that he was giving a large gift to God. Other people came into the church. Some were like the rich man and made a great noise dropping their money so people would think that they were giving a big gift to God. Up the stairs came a sweet-faced woman. She did not wear fine clothes. She did not need a bag because she had only two very little pieces of money with her. Very quietly, she walked up to the gift box and put the two pieces in it. As the woman heard the tinkle of the coins in the box, she was thinking, I wish I had more to give to God. He is so good to me. I would like to say my thanks to him with a great bag full of money, but this is all I have. Jesus watched the woman walk away. Then he said, This poor woman gave a greater gift than any of the others. She kept nothing for herself, but gave to God all that she had and with a loving heart. And he said that people will always remember her. And we do, even over 2,000 years later, we still remember the woman who gave all she had with a loving heart. Well, that's it for tonight. I hope you have sweet dreams, and I hope to see you tomorrow. So remember, God loves you, and I do too. Bye-bye.